Hello guys, welcome back to my world of miniature wind turbines. Uh, I'm going to put this brief video on because I want you to see this test. It's my NEMA 42 stepper motor that I am going to be uh, using my new wind turbine blades for and you'll see that video very shortly. But right now I want to show you just how much AC voltage we can get out of this uh, NEMA 42 stepper motor and if you know anything about stepper motors you'll know that this these things are pretty big I'm gonna to touch it so you can see that's a pretty big motor okay and I've got it hooked up to this voltmeter on AC because it generates AC when you uh, turn the shaft or the armature first you need to know that um, I've got it on the lowest possible um, RPM setting that I can do on uh, this particular drill press. It's a small drill press and the noise you're hearing is uh, from my, I'm doing my laundry at the same time. Our house has two laundry rooms and the uh, larger laundry room I do some of my work in it. That's why you hear the uh, washer and the dryer going. But uh, here you can see what the uh, pulleys have to be set at in order to get to uh, 740 RPMs. And I'm bringing it out so you can see that I'm on 740 RPM setting. Okay? Now I'm going to turn it on so you can see just how uh, impressive this NEMA 42 stepper motor is. Here we go. 128 volts AC. That's what I plan to get out of uh, my new wind turbine blades. The only problem is that this is uh, a lot of AC voltage. You know I'm going to have to convert it to DC but uh, in the meantime, I can get an awful lot. I'm only using one coil off of that stepper motor. If I run both coils in series, I can get a lot more AC than this. I just wanted, to, uh, wanted you guys to see this because uh, I really like this motor. And again, uh, please leave your comments about this test and please subscribe so you can see my next video. Thank you. Goodbye.